hello everyone. It seems like my microphone doesn't want to work right now. So, and, um, but we'll have lots of fun anyhow. So it's always a party at Patchwork. So let's get this party started. Woot, woot. Hi everyone, this is Julie from Patchworks and I am so excited that you're joining us for another Must Sew TV tonight here at Patchworks. We are coming at you on Friday instead of Thursday because we've had so many exciting things going on at the store and we wanted to make sure that we could give you a full program. So, we are going to flip overhead and take a peek at our bundle of the week. And then I'll see if I can connect my microphone a little better. So, our bundle of the week is right here. And it is really fun. So I think we're going to just play along with having this weird microphone thing happening and that's all right. So um, we'll just take it from here. So look at this, isn't this great? We are having so much fun with red, white, and blue colors, and we just thought this would be a perfect, perfect, perfect bundle to start our kind of warmish weather and also go along with a lot of the fun things that we've been looking at over the past couple of weeks. So what do you think? We call it the Americana Bundle of the Week. Now, if you're not familiar with our Bundles of the Week, Every week we put together 12 amazing fat quarters here. Sometimes they're from a line, sometimes we curate them separately. Here we put things together all across the board, some that have a little bit of a theme to it and others that were a little bit more of a basic. Put those together. Regularly our fat stacks start at $39. This bundle here is only $24.99. And because it's so awesome and so amazing and so many of you love, love, love these kind of colors, we put together a double pack, which is the half yard pack. And that is double the price for $49.98, I believe. So scoop those up while they last. Let me grab a code for you. I'm going to talk really loud since I'm away from the camera right now. Our bundle of the week is always on the front page of the website. I think we're only able to um, get the comments on Facebook today. So we are in the last couple weeks of using this Restream program. We're going to be going to a different program um, in a couple weeks. And so... Uh, some of our technical difficulties should be going away at that point. But lots of really great fun things, so I hope you enjoy it. Quantities are limited, so you want to make sure to scoop those up sooner than later. All right, so what else do we have to show you? Well, I'm going to flip it and I'm going to show you the quilt behind me. With the quilt behind me, look at this, isn't this pretty? It is Mary Seelan's version of Chatsworth. So Chatsworth is that program that we kicked off at the beginning of the year and we've been working on it and we were waiting for a bunch of fabrics to be coming in and we finally had fabric coming in. So we're super excited to be spending a little bit more time with all of the people who have been quilting on this. And 
Mary was so excited. So she had started working on this before we even started our program. And she chose her own adventure with beautiful Holly Taylor fabrics. And isn't this amazing? So if you were thinking about starting this project or you were thinking you didn't like the fabric choices that we offered, I wanted to show you, you could choose so many different things. So take a peek here at this gorgeous, gorgeous, gorgeous quilt. Isn't that pretty? So there's 12 different blocks there and then there's some sashing strips. Let me hop back over here to make that little comment go away. All right, so uh, you can see here that there are 12 beautiful sampler blocks there and each of them then is set in a larger square. So the center block is an eight inch finished block and then it is set in a star point. And then there are these braided flying geese that are filler along the way. We'll be talking about those braided flying geese in the very near future, but we did put together a fun little board here for how they go together and they work with some foundation paper. That was designed specifically for the Chatsworth quilt, but you can use it for a bunch of different things. So if I show you here, papers come like this. Okay, and when we have them quilted up, they look just like that. Trim them to size and you put them into the quilt. You can make them for all of the leftovers of your fabrics that you're using for your sampler squares. Or if you're just making your own little project with them, like we did right here. You can just play with whatever fabrics that you like. So we decided that we would make a fun little topper or large cushion with just eight of these blocks. So I just wanted to give you a little bit of a teaser about those fun shapes. And as I said, we'll be chatting about those a little bit more in the coming weeks. And the Chatsworth book is right here. And it has the whole sampler pattern as well as bonus projects in the back side of it. So check it out, stop in, see what we have going on, and uh, you too can join in the fun. It's a little warm here, so I'm gonna take my sweater off. So thank you to everyone who is joining us today. If you just are tuning in, uh, we are on a little bit different of a microphone setup today. So I'm going to do my best to talk so that you can all hear me. And uh, I'm having a little bit of a challenge sharing links. We will have that resolved uh, as we are in the process of switching over platforms to be able to have a smoother set up for us as we've had a couple issues over the past few weeks. So we were talking about Doug's Chatsworth and one of my other favorite recent books that we have from him is Tabletastic 3. So we just, we were talking red, white, and blue with our bundle of the week and we have a new table topper to show you. So let me go grab it. <gasps> Look at this. Isn't 
Isn't this fun? This is from the Tabletastic 3 book, and we made it from leftovers of a quilt that I'm just going to show you. This is featuring fabric from Old Glory by Lella Boutique. And the pattern is, oh goodness, I should have had that memorized, right? This is dun, 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 Surrey. So one of the fun thing about Doug's books that he's been making lately are that a lot of the pattern names are named after uh, British landmarks. And it's just kind of fun that you can take a little travel across the pond while you are making some of Doug's fun designs. So this is one of 20 table toppers that is in this book. It is Tabletastic 3, $24.99, and we have it in store and on the website. So I had mentioned that this was leftovers of a different project. Did you want to see the project that created these leftovers? Okay, I thought you did. We made Sweetland, and this is featuring the Sweetland of Liberty panel. Let's see. I don't know if I can get far enough away, but this one here is really fun. It's a panel quilt that finishes uh, 48 by 54. It takes a panel, 29 10 inch squares, so a layer cake or bundle. Then it takes white fabric, an inner border, uh, sawtooth star point print fabric, binding fabric, and your backing. Now this is finishes 50, it's 48 by 54. So do you know what? We used boring gray fabric on the back, but do you know what you could use? You could use the 60 inch wide fabric for the line. Wouldn't that be fun? One with the fabric, no piecing. It's not a wide back, it's a 60 wide, and it's printed on the same quality fabric as the 45s, so it's really, really nice. I also think you could just quilt this up and maybe use it as the fabric if you wanted to make one of those cool elemental quilt coats. So if you've been watching in our Patchworks party, Joe and Laura were just at uh, Red Roxy Quilt Company in Iowa for a quilt retreat with Teresa Coates, who is the pattern designer of this pattern. And they had shared some really fun coats. And Laura had used a uh, quilt, quilted, uh, pieced quilt that she then turned into a coat. Joe used quilted fabric. And so something like this could be super fun to do that. All right, just a tangent. So that would be great backing. I brought over the fabrics that we use. So panels right here. And we made together these fabric bundles here. They are 10 by 21 inches. So it's like a layer cake equivalent without being a layer cake. And because it's 10 inches, we made it a little bit generous, like a 10 and a half inch. So there's 20 pieces. So it's a tighter collection. There's So they'd be equivalent of 40 10 inch squares plus a little bit extra. And these are the exact fabrics that we used in making our sample. You're only using 29 squares in making the quilt. And so the leftovers are what we used for the table runner. So it's like a twofer, okay? You get a quilt, 
you also can have the leftover fabric for that table topper and I think you probably even end up with a little bit extra. So we used a solid white, the Moda Bella Solid 98 for our white background in both. For the binding for the quilt, we used the red stripe from the fabric line. For our inner border, we used uh, one of Lella Boutique's just polka dots, okay? So we didn't use the actual gray from the line. We wanted to choose a different piece, but um, these dots, they're gonna be coming out as a basic, which I'm so excited about. This had been from the Christmas Eve line, and we actually even marked it down, even though it's amazing, uh, just because, well, it was the, with the Christmas fabric, and that was before I knew it turned into a basic. But we use this for our inner border. If you wanted to use something from the line, you could pull something like this, or you could choose a different color, you could do a solid, whatever you wanted to. For the table topper, we went ahead and used the most Moda Bias binding on a roll because I love it a lot. And um, you could even use that for the quilt if you had wanted to. It works super well. And if you've never ever used one, you might wanna just get some to try on a small project uh, if you were doubting uh, how awesome it actually is. And after you love it, you might just go ahead and then a special order for me whole rolls of these. I was talking at a guild this week and I was telling them that I actually have a few colors at home and then when I'm binding a quilt with one of them, I literally just take this roll and I put it on my thread, my um, vertical thread spool holder on my sewing machine and then I just peel it off while I stitch it and then there's literally no waste because I cut off exactly what I need and then um, join my ends and go from there. But uh, I love, love, love this stuff. And um, it's just super awesome. And it's made from the regular 45 inch Moda fabric. So the Bella Solids, the Grunges, the Thatched. It's available in limited colors, but it's super cool. I'm just gonna take a peek here and see if we have any comments now. All right. Okay, so for the Old Glory fabric line, we still have half yard bundles of the whole line, fat quarter bundles of the whole line, just a few of them. We have those fabric bundles that are a layer cake equivalent. So 20 fabrics that are 10 and a half by half a width of fabric. So it's the uh, uh, layer cake equivalent. We have some jelly rolls, some honey buns, mini charms, I think charms as well, as well as limited yardage. So you'll wanna make sure to scoop some up sooner than later if you love the line. And you know, this here, this is super cool stuff. So it is $14.96 a yard. It is 60 inches wide. And I think we have um, probably about 18 yards left. So you'll wanna scoop that up. Thanks to everybody who's just joining and watching us or has watched us from the start. All right, so we had looked at our new quilt. We have the Chatsworth quilt behind us. So this week we got, uh, actually on Friday, last Friday, a week ago, we got the Roar fabric from Tula Pink. Oh, it was so crazy, so fun, so exciting. We have more on order, which is really, really exciting. Uh, I'm going to show you some of the fun key pieces that we have. As I said, we're out of a couple of them. Don't worry, we're getting more. 
but if you were interested in, because they went so quick, if you were interested in full yard bundles or half yard bundles, I have put a pre-order link on uh, the website right in the collection. So you'll want to make sure to pre-order that. We're looking at just a couple weeks out for those. So, um, but I know they're going to go quick. Um, so if you were looking at that whole piece, make sure you get a request in so that we can make it happen. I'm going to roll over that fabric and then we're going to take a peek and look overhead at those. Rolling the cart over. I'm going to switch to the overhead camera. Okay, so um, can you hear me now? If you're just tuning in now, I had shared that um, we're switching over our platform for our broadcasting in a couple weeks, and so hopefully our technical challenges will go away. So uh, these project bags, I was talking about the two law, and thank you so much, I just wasn't able to see in front of me that um, these project bags here are in stock. We have about a dozen of these left. You could use them as the project bag themselves, or you could uh, take them apart and use them for vinyl in a different project. Okay, and I was also sharing that the yardage was going super quick. So I think I said that on the other camera. We have pre-order links up for the bundles if you were looking for those. So we're going to look first at the key piece of this line which is the T-Rex. Isn't he cute? He's so funky and cute. So really interesting scale. It goes really well with uh, true colors. It also, these go very, very well with other lines because, you know, Tula really does a really good job of making her stuff go together. And I just pulled out some tiny dots here so you can see for reference how well things go together, okay? Uh, if you've been watching Tula and all of her special social medias she's been showing you how everything works together and different fun combos oh so lots of fun and as i mentioned this is tree rex <laughs> tree rex so that is one color and then we have the tree rex in the other color here we have the Triceratops, so the trifecta. This is kind of a border print. So we have um, all the key fabrics that were short on or out of, back on order. And this is the other colorway. This is the blush, super pretty.
This is the gift wrapped. And this is the color that matches the bag, right? We also have it in the other colors. The blush. Wing it. Flowers. Flying pterodactyl. And this is the other colorway we're getting back in as well. Meteor shower. We only have in the bright pink, the hot pink right now, the Storm also on order, and that one is the one that matches this bag. Only a dozen of the bags left. These I won't be able to get back in. The flowers, oh, so pretty. Which leads me to, if you haven't seen it yet, Tula's fall line is going to be just flowers. It's going to be so amazing. And if you aren't into dinosaurs or animals or people, it's going to be beautiful florals. And so um, if you love her wild colors and themes, that's going to be a great line for you. And of course, we are getting it all. We have these available in the wide back as well. And you can see how the scale is different. So these are the silky wide backs. This would be great if you were uh, making a garment. Uh, I think Roberta's making some drapes with these. You could make duvet covers, of course, back a quilt. These are 108. And the pink here, is more vibrant than this pink, but it's super beautiful. And I think this could work really well for many a Tula line for wide backs. This is the Northern Lights. I'm going to uh, switch cameras to be able to show you how this looks. All right, so hopefully we still have sound. And look at that, isn't that pretty? So it's really, I know that the, the screen is probably going crazy. It's going bananas with the, all the pixelation on that, but you can see how it's like lightning strikes on that. So we have it with the pink background and also with the white background, okay? I'm going to just put this back, layer things back, and then we're gonna look at the dinosaur eggs, which really are giant polka dots, and we're gonna take a look at how the different scales of the dinosaur eggs versus the true colors versus the tiny true colors all go together. So I think it's really fun how the dots work. All right, let me see here. Perfect for fussy cutting. And if you are commenting on YouTube right now, I will be checking your comments after. Sadly, I'm not able to see all of the great comments right now. They must have known that we're switching platforms and have um, made some of our <laughs> existing functionality go away. Oh, goodness. So 
So while I'm wrapping this up, I'm super excited. I'm going to be going to a show in Chicago uh, first week of May called H&H &H Americas. And that is where it's replacing Spring Quilt Market. And so it's really fun. And you're going to have to let me know if there's certain things that I should check out. I'm excited to be able to meet up with some of my quilty friends and meet up with industry professionals, check out new product. They're going to be releasing new stuff there. I'll be ordering the Untamed. That was the new Tula line that's going to be out in fall. And um, I know Moda is going to be releasing some new fabric. Let's go back and take a look at those dinosaur eggs and those different dots. Okay, so dinosaur eggs, giant. You can, my hand for reference. Okay. If you think about them as just giant dots and not dinosaur eggs, um, they're like, oh yeah, polka, giant polka dots. Okay, so then this is the first, um, this is the pom-pom, which is the original dot that Tula released. And then here is the tiny dot, tiny true color. So you can see how they all work together. Isn't that super fun? Okay, so really fun dots here. Well, we've been having a lot of fun with Tula things and we've been getting in, uh, we got restocked on basics. So Heidi went ahead and she remade or made for the first time some towers for us. So we have towers now of all of the fairy dust. Isn't that great? So we have four fat quarter towers of this. And there are 10 in here. Okay. So that is $35. And then we have, uh, a hexi fat stack, so there's 12 in here, so this is 42. And we did the rainbow as well as just the plain hexes. Can we see them all in here? Do they fit? I think they fit. And then we also have the mineral And so we've been bundling, 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 just trying to keep up with all the bundles because we know that a lot of times it's easier to just, if you're wanting a run of colors or things like that, to just grab the bundle and then start playing with it. And then if you need a little bit of extra fabric, then you just come and get a little bit of extra fabric. But this is just a really nice starter for working on projects. This is the mineral, and this is a fat stack, and this is also 42. So, new Tula fat stacks of existing fabrics, but these go really well with prints new and old, right? Look at that. Really works. It goes really nice. So, if you have lots of different focus fabrics that you don't know quite what to do with, grab yourself some of these coordinate packs so that we can you can build some really exciting stuff all right and so thank you for all the feedback on the love of the bundles i know that you do love them because you've been scooping them up and we have been cutting and folding like mad scientists over here i don't know if that's quite the right uh, analogy there, but it sounded good, right?
So what else do I have to show you? Well, I'm gonna show you a couple other bundles that I have for you, and then we're gonna get into some new stuff that we have. Now, before we hop over to um, some of the other bundles we've created, since these are kind of rainbow-ish, I wanted to share with you the pouch of the month from So Luck. So we don't have that one made up yet, but the rainbow pouch is the So Lux pouch of the month that we have in stock. And we even have a few rainbow charms that are zipper pulls. And so this was made with some Melody Miller uh, Ruby Star fabric, but you could absolutely use your favorite rainbow themed collection in order to have your rainbow. Any scraps would work as well. And you know, there's no nothing to say that even the whole band of the rainbow has to be the same fabric. You could use different fabrics for each piece and just have it be super scrappy. That could be really fun too, to just use up a bunch of scraps. And you know, when you do that, scraps make babies. So, you know, I don't know necessarily that will help use up your scraps, but it'll be fun to use your scraps, right? So, and then, um, well, since we're talking about zipper charms, this one came back in. So we have, we have a whole bunch of charms that zipper charms that have been on order and they just come in as they come back in stock. And so you'll see them back on the wall and I do my best to share with you in our videos when they're back in stock. But the Lovely Bloom Wildflower three pack and the three pack is $16.99. Uh, that is back in stock. And yes, Laura, I just saw that that what we've been looking at is definitely a great intro into the new Tula line. Absolutely, absolutely. So excited for that one. All right. Other packs that we put together. So this one, oh, this one's really fun. We have an art gallery pack that we just put together. Let's look overhead. Hopefully you can still hear me. And this one is a low volume pack. And it's a mix the volume pack. Really fun. And so you have 12 fabrics here. And a lot of times when you're playing with low volume, it is fun to just play with all sorts of textures and things like that. So this one here, this is a $39 fat stack. Mix the volume by Art Gallery. Next up, we are going to look at some autumnal packs. So this fabric is not new to the shop, but these fat sticks are new. We thought since we had full collections of these autumnal lines that we would put them together for you in, for in a grab and go because, well, you know, sewing for different seasons, we can't wait till the last minute and we wanted to make sure that you had time to put some packs, projects together. I love these mushrooms. So this is the Give Thanks Fat Stack from, or by Kim Schaefer, Andover Fabrics. Really pretty. And it doesn't have to be Thanksgiving and Harvest. You know, it really is just a color and this is would be a great kitchen or home deck item that could be year round depending on your decor. So this is a $39 pack. And then um, I put together a, or Heidi put together, a Forest Frolic by Robin Pickens pack as well. And these really could even work together color wise if you were looking to expand the range. So I'm just gonna hold them together here. You can see that they're nice saturated colors and they're 
they're not modeled backgrounds, so they really do work well together. And so I love that, and I wanted to show them together as well. So this is the Robin Pickens Forest Frolic. We still have quite a bit of this line, and this is also uh, one where there are linens that go with this line. Really nice textures, and I love the floral component of this. So those are two additional fat stacks that we have for you. All right. Other new things that we have, or new newly put together things. We finished putting together the Salute kit. I'm gonna look at that ahead of me. So an Americana quilt kit. I showed you the Salute fabric by Andover. I think that was last week. And I said we'd be working on kits of this and we have some kits put together. It is $119.99, and the quilt kit, the quilt finishes 63 by 63. It includes the pattern and front for fabric for your front and binding. We have our own little box kit here that we put together with everything that you need, as well as the pattern. During the month of May, we will be making this particular quilt, and we will also be sharing with you, uh, one week we'll be sharing with you how to make the star block, next week we'll be showing you how to be making the log cabin block, and then we'll be talking about putting everything together. So uh, a little pseudo quilt along, and if you are looking to play along with the exact fabrics, you're gonna to wanna to scoop up one of these kits. It's available in store and online. So I had mentioned we had gotten a few new things and they came today, new, new, new. So we're still getting them into the system and online. But since um, everything, since we haven't, since I wasn't with you yesterday, I thought, I should at least show you these things, and if you had needed it, make sure to pop it in the comments, and I will grab it for you. So the first one that we're going to look at is Stash Statement. So Stash Statement is a new book by Kelly Young, Make the Most of Your Fabrics with Easy Improv Quilts. It is by Landauer Publishing. And it was visually interesting, so I thought we needed it. All sorts of great things, just using your scraps. Of course, you can buy fabric to, to make things, but I love colorful, unique designs, and I thought this fit the bill. Then, we have Color Basics for Makers, Understanding the Rainbow by Lee Chappelle Monroe. And this is a spiral bound CNT publishing book. Good reading, good learning, understanding color theory in quilters terms. So, you know, some of these terms are a little academic, but she's, you know, plays with how you can put it into use as well as how to pick your palette. And this is $19.95. These will both be on the website by tomorrow at the latest. And of course, if you had needed it, let me know beforehand and I will make sure to reserve you a copy. And, you know, these colorful things do go along as a repeat with our rainbow pouch that we have 
as our featured So Lux pouch of the month, along with our rainbow charms. And then these might be my favorite new things that we got in this package. And so Sarah Hartz has some woven labels and premium woven labels. And we had um, decided that we just can't live without them anymore. So it's about a dollar a label because there's a pack of eight and these are $8 each. So in this particular one, it's stitched with love. There's metallic thread in here. Nice ample size and you can see here how it is a um a woven ribbon and so on this particular one you could sew it on the sides or you could sew all around the perimeter this one quilting is my superpower eight identical tags in here and this one is a folded tag eight to the pack eight dollar pack so it's a dollar a label and then this one might be my favorite so this one there are eight tags but there's two each of four different designs so here's a rotary cutter and there's a little bit of metallic in there and it's two-sided, okay. A sewing machine. Measuring tape. And thread, okay. Once again, dollar a tag, so this is an $8 pack. Super, super fun. These will be posted on the site no later than tomorrow as well, but is available immediately in the store. Also, make sure to let me know if you were interested in me reserving you a set. These will go quick and um, we will be restocking, of course, uh, but we just always like to test out new project products, especially if uh, we're not sure what you'll think about um, some of the fun new gifties that we bring in. Because, you know, of course, I think you love everything I love, but sometimes we guess wrong. So uh, we brought in a few and if you love it, we'll, of course, bring in a lot more. All right. Lastly, you know, this isn't new, but we have a deal for you guys today. And this is just a one up if somebody was interested in it. So this beautiful canvas here, this is a Tim Holtz canvas. And we were cutting it for a customer today. And there was a little bit of an oopsie in it uh, that was wound on it. So this is the Embark canvas. It is $16.99 a yard. There was a manufacturer flaw in this piece that um, there's a little rip here. So not that big of a deal, but you can see there's a little bit of a problem. And so we can't sell it as first quality. So we have one yard of this $16.99 fabric that I would sell to someone for $8. So first person who says me can uh, I will save it for you and invoice you or save it for you for when you come in and if no one claims it it'll be available in the store we have one available but I thought that we would give you guys first shot because well you're watching me and I want to make sure that we could offer you that all right and of course if you love it but wanted more yardage, we do have a little bit left on the bolt. So that's what I got tonight. We have a, that beautiful fat stack that we started with at the beginning of the night. Great Americana stack. 
We have the Chatsworth quilt that's behind me. And that was completed by Mary Seelan. So thank you so much for sharing that with us. Uh, we still have Chatsworth book available and we have some kits with the colorways that we're doing, but you can do it in whatever fabric that you like. And we'll be spending some more time in the next few months talking more about the blocks and construction and things like that. The roar came in. We are getting more because it's so exciting. Um, so that new things will be coming. Make sure if you are interested in yard bundles or additional yardage of specific prints to scoop up what we have in stock now and or let me know what you need, okay? Because uh, this is not a basic fabric, so it's not going to be available forever. And we have a new couple new samples. So we have that Table Tastic 3 Surrey. This was made from leftovers of the panel quilt, Sweet Land of Liberty. And this is the quilt. So thank you so much for tuning in tonight. Thank you for uh, playing along with our technical difficulties. We're changing things over. And uh, so hopefully things will be a little bit smoother. Also, as I said, we are going to be going to H&H &H, uh, first week of May. So I'll have one more week to be able to gather thoughts from you if there's specific things that you want us to check out uh, along the way because we're going to be it is a buyer show, so I'll be able to meet people, buy things, all sorts of great stuff. And it's going to be lots of fun, taking some classes, going to be gone a whole week. I'll be back on Saturday, May 4th, but it will be that whole first week of May. So Tuesday through Friday, I will be out of the store uh, getting some special training, buying stuff, and meeting some fun people. So... Thank you so much for tuning in tonight. I very much appreciate you spending time on your Friday night. Happy quilting, and we'll see you soon.